I'm about to see throughout this video while I'm pointing out key points, the proof, the evidence, all that. So stay tuned because it's really out of control. Like, let's really talk about it. Let's really talk about it. It's your girl Hollywood Tay or whatever. And I'm back here with another video. So as you can see from the title of this video, I gotta put y'all on. Like for real though. Can we get into it? Because baby. <clears throat> as y'all know, Laura and the Raleigh, they be doing way too much for this money because there's no way. How you come from? saying you being abused to saying how you been treated poorly if you look at me now this is what i look like now but best believe that me i've gone through getting cheated on i've gone through getting abused i've gone and taken advantage of i've gone and used in so many ways that are unforgivable but that's okay it's all gonna be okay because the way that i look now i have one eyebrow Everything that's on my face right now, it's all going to go away with due time. And now y'all back together. Mama has been changing. She just made me some breakfast, right? Yes, Daddy. We got the uh, our housekeeper putting up the kitchen tree. Mommy chilling. So let's see. Look, hey, you're doing amazing. I love hey, you. I will never cheat on you because you're acting right. right. I've been good for how many hours? Twenty four whole going hours. Twenty four. It's going on twenty four hours. Hey, make yes. my breakfast, baby. Thank you. Make it make sense, baby. You moved out. Respect. No respect. You're literally putting your stuff in trash bags. Yes, I'm yes, taking my bags. stuff to you all. Yeah, it's right. storming I outside. So I'll go in the storm. I don't care. I'll take all of my stuff to get away from you. That's crazy. Get away from me. Is it crazy? My kids are not going nowhere in the storm. I will take my kids with me too. My kids are not going nowhere in the storm. Just call your mom to get them when the it's storming over. in Houston. You. Then you didn't move. You went back to the house. As y'all can see, I'm back home. I've had my time to cry. I've had my time to be depressed. But now it's time to speak up and speak for my I have went through so much in the last 48 hours that I myself am not even comfortable, not even comfortable with speaking on. She always was popping in and out to the crib. I bought you a Porsche. I bought you a Cadillac Escalade. You wanted a mommy truck. I bought you a, Sh a Chevy Tahoe, a bigger mommy truck. I bought you another Cadillac Escalade ESV for Valentine's Day, and now I bought you a G-Wagon. And this is how you treat me? This is how you treat me? I just dropped 200 plus bands on you. I got over 100,000 just chilling right here. And this is how you choosing to treat me. Girl, it's giving, it's a whole skit. Like, we been knew y'all was doing skits for money, but this takes the cake. Because now you pregnant with twins, and your HGG levels or whatever it was went mad low. You was bleeding, you wasn't eating, you went distant and not going on live for a few days. Now you back and got back together. After she violated you on live, saying that, oh, you don't even know if you're going to make it that far with those kids. Night. I made up my mind that she will not be in the C-section delivery room, but you will. How, how do you even know you're gonna make it to the C-section delivery room? Oh my god. What? What? I'm just saying. You know, that's... Dude. I'm that's not evil. talking to her anymore. I'm not talking to her. How do you know she's gonna make it to the, to the, to the, uh, to the delivery room? We don't know Who that. says that? Who says that? We don't know that. That's why. And then you don't need to know. You don't wish nobody something like that. I didn't say nothing bad. Me personally, I just couldn't. Mm -mm. That all the tag tools, my mom, my mom, my mom. I've been telling you to not do that since the day you got it. Like, grr. Then, then it make matters worse. You shaving off your eyebrow. 
for me. I right? just want to make you happy. Yeah, hey, shave, shave your eyebrow then, bitch. Show me. This will make you happy? Dude, this is what I said? You're going to make me repeat myself? No, daddy. This will make you happy? That's what Can I promise? said. Me shaving my eyebrow? Bitch, did I just say that? Yes, Did I just said it. Right. This one, Daddy. That one right there. This makes you happy. Yeah. I just want to make you happy, Daddy. So do what I say. I don't yeah. even need a mirror, Daddy. Just do no what I say. I just need you, Daddy. Come on, you're not doing good enough. Go down. Go down. Go down right there. Here? Yeah. Come on. Yeah, there you go. You're a good bitch. I don't need nothing get in up. life, Daddy. Just you. There you go. Just Let you, Daddy. Let me see. Yeah. Let me see. Let me see. No, Daddy, I don't want to scratch up my Laura tattoo. Look here. Look here. Stop. Is it you did good. Yeah. Daddy. You, good, bitch. Good girl. Is Round of applause. Round of applause. Good girl. You barking like a dog. You want a full crawling girl? This is the Nadja family estate. Baby mama, you eating your treats? Huh? Wait, Daddy. You eating your treats? Daddy, you know I am. That's what you're talking about. Daddy. He eating them. Hurry up. Let me see you. Good no, girl. Them them Where's your life. leash? Daddy got right you a there, leash. Baby. Where is it? Right there, baby. You got your leash on? Yeah. It's okay. Use, hey, here in a little bit, you know, I'm going to have to put that leash on you because, you know, your daddy's doggy, bitch. Baby daddy, I already know that, baby daddy. I follow the rules. Got a new tattoo today? I you look you swollen. Is your face okay? It's all bruised up and shit. You going to yeah. be all right? I can't let it happen to my dog. Daddy, I'm perfectly fine, daddy. It's just a little swelling because it's on my forehead. Hey, you a really good baby mama. Two kids. Twins on the way. You a really good girl. Thank you, I've daddy. stayed cheating on the bitch. Yeah, eat your truck. You know what I'm saying? Y'all see, she got her leash over there. I'm going to put it on her. Hey, I didn't ask you to bark. Eat your food. But it's my baby mama. You know what I'm saying? This is a young, low baby mama. Turn around, bitch. Let me see your face touch. Look at that. No eyebrow. I told the bitch remove her eyebrow. Daddy says she wants the girls with a no brow. Boom. Done. The delusional... She was doing was just like, girl, you doing too much. It's giving you trying too hard to please this girl. That's what it's giving. And I'm just like, baby, I know you lying. But <laughs> the way how you know it's a skit, though, after all of that you just seen. Bro, it's just common sense. First of all, it's just no way you go back to her after being degraded, publicly humiliated, all of these different things, and you go back to her. Then you want to say it's a trauma bond relationship, and want to say, and just giving up any excuses that why y'all was together, why you didn't leave when you post supposed to leave long time ago, etc. Yes, I understand that every time my baby daddy cheated on me or disrespected me or degraded me for the whole wide world, the whole internet to see, yes, I took her back. I took her back time after time after time. Why? I'll tell y'all why. Because I am in a trauma bond that I'm trying to get myself out of. If you ever been in a situation shit, like a situation like this, then you know exactly how hard it is to get out of it. And you know how hard something like this is to go through. What I'm going through is no joke, and I'll tell y'all the truth. She used to lie to me. She used to tell me all the cheating was fake. Yeah, it wasn't fake. I caught so many stuff in her phone. I caught so many lies, and enough is enough. My family doesn't deserve this. I don't deserve this as a woman. I am the best woman, and I've treated her the absolute best for her to turn around and backstab me in my face like this. Girl don't even have no family of her own. Norali literally cut her whole family off for Laura. She literally has no choice but it's literally given. <laughs> you got kids with her and all that. You far going. There's no coming back from her. There is no coming back to where you came from. You feel me? So, it's really just given. They just lying for just anything. Then it's just like... You really going out your way to please somebody that's not even doing right by you? But you this boss, babe. You the you the queen of TikTok and all of this, that and there. Yeah, you get subscriptions. Yeah, people spam y'all with gifts on a live and they be going crazy. Whoop to you do for that. But baby girl, let's really get into it. Because you're really a nobody. No Raleigh. <laughs> You really a nobody. Y'all will literally 
go poof like that. After Michaela and Laura broke up and y'all did this whole little skit just to get together and all of this stuff. It's just like y'all just been doing anything for money. Y'all notice the toxicity and the drama gives y'all more clout, gives y'all more money, gives y'all more views. So y'all keeping it up. But y'all not realizing y'all got kids now. Like y'all doing a little bit too much around these children. So my oh she don't let me see my baby. She don't let me see my kids. Bro, you said you said you said I got my kid. Let me talk. You're being bitter. You said I got have my kids on Baba's day. You said it. You said it. Bro, you told you told me I could have my. You told me I could have them on Baba's day. You bro, you told me I could have my kids on Baba's day. You're being bitter. You, why are you being a? Why are you being a? Girl, like, like let's be real. That's not probably what's going on. But it's the principle. Y'all doing way too much. And then when they get old enough, I'm pretty sure even if y'all deleted this, people who, like me, gonna have clips and little things speaking about it. And they're gonna look at y'all like, what was y'all doing back in the day? Like, y'all was tweaking out while I was over here sucking my bottle. Like, what did he say? Like, oh. like what? Like, that's wicked. <laughs> but... <laughs> They be doing way too much for the money. They be doing way too much for the bag. And me personally, this is levels. You're supposed to have like respect for yourself. I don't feel like you should have had did all of that just for money, just for clout, just for the hype. Y'all already made it. They live in this nice place. They be recording in all over their TikTok and stuff like that, bragging about their finances and all of this. They rich. They go They go to the bank all the time and pull out money. They even show their revenue, how much they make, and this and this and that off OnlyFans and all these different things they be doing. Like, y'all make bank. So I'm just not understanding why y'all still need to keep this fake breakup, makeup, toxicity, narcissistic behavior keep going on. It's not... The math ain't mathing. If one plus one is two, and two plus two is four, then what is this? That's what I'm asking. That's the real question. Do y'all have nothing else better to do with y'all lies just to just make up stuff? And then it's not even giving the Raleigh's even pregnant. Because how in one picture, she looking kind of, you know, big at the stomach in video. And then in another picture, well, recently when she's in this white dress, and I'm going to show y'all, she's in this white dress. And her stomach is a little flabby. What are you thinking? And I deserve daddy. You look beautiful, baby. I will never cheat. Let me see the inches on your hair. Every time I see you, hair done, heels on. You look phenomenal. I will never cheat on you again. Let me see you. Like, just regular flat. I know they did the transfer for the twins because they showed the proof of that. But I don't think she's pregnant yet. Like, full-blown pregnant. I really feel like either she had a miscarriage because of all the stress, if it really was real what they was doing, and they just trying to cover it up now because they have money and they could just get her pregnant right away again. But it's either that or her body's just not showing she's pregnant, which is weird because she's supposed to be a little ways in at this point, the way how they was making it seem. So it's just like, where the belly? Where the belly? Like, where's the belly, baby? So, it's a lot of question marks with them. Like, real life. A lot, a lot of question marks. Because I'm trying to figure out, like, what is really happening? The pregnancy problems. The stuff around the children. They don't even get me started with Laura's mother. Her mother wants to pretend to shut things down like she's not with nothing. But And it's going to be another clip where I'm going to show, like, her saying, Oh, Laura, don't do that. Don't do this. And don't talk to me like you talk like that. Why you don't have respect for your own mother? That who raised you? Answer, hey, 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 hey. When young low speak, I want to hear you, all right? Oh, no, that's not I want to hear you. Hey, lady, I'm speaking. I'm speaking. Let me just say something, yeah? What you saying is irrelevant. I don't care what you talking about. I don't got to respect you. You're not my mother. You cut off a show. Go in that kitchen. Make me a burger. Stop talking. But the next breath, she's following along whatever Laura's doing. Granted, I get it. Laura pays the bills. For you, basically, because 
what I don't know what kind of job she has, but it don't seem like they do anything that requires too much because Lauren Nevada does all of this for money. They clearly do something for you and you all and you now all of a sudden always in their videos and TikToks. Like she's been actively there. And I'm not just talking about for the kids, she's the grandparent, of course she's gonna be there. But you know what I mean. For those who watch them, you know. You're gonna see another video where she's legit just saying, Oh, you know my baby, you know she do this and this and this and that. Cash up here, what is that? Sixty five thousand. Sixty five thousand right now from the bank just to get my baby mama yeah. a car. Hey mom, yeah, you next. You a young little mom, so what do you want? Porsche. You want she the Porsche? The Porsche? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get you the Porsche next. Yeah. Let me get let me get her this Range Rover, and then you are gonna get that Porsche next, yo. Yeah. yeah. We going to, after this. We are going to the bank for your car. We get yeah. you the Porsche because you a young little mom, that's, and you that's a, because you have to say sorry. Sorry. To all right. All right. Yes. And then you because you a young little right. baby mama, the young yeah. little kids. Yellow you see, y'all got a lot to say about me, Mommy but y'all can't do this. Y'all can't walk in and get y'all a brand new Range Rover. Alu. Cash. Alu. Yes. Cash. Alu. Alu. Uh -huh. My baby Young Glow is the best. And Period. let me tell you one Period. thing. Yeah. She was the reason my Young Glow, she has to I'm do jealous. Exactly. I'm jealous. She was okay. jealous. My I'm baby jealous. does not do that. Not Never exactly. did. And it's like, which one is it? Is your daughter a narcissist and she take from her dad and all that she was saying? Or is it giving, it's a skip. And you just say whatever to make it look innocent, to make it look more realistic because you're the parent. Just throw the money you keep coming in on everybody's eyes. Which one is it? Somebody tell me, I must need, I need to know. But yeah. And then after all of that, let's really get down to the nitty gritty on how Norali one minute want to be all crying, depressed. Looking like she gets beat up. <laughs> She'll leave, have a bruise on her face, leave, going through the, oh, my baby said she like the girl with the green hair. Get her hair green. Shave up her eyebrow. My baby daddy said she wanted the girls with the green hair. Baby, at first she said she wanted the girls with the pink hair. We did pink. She got tired of it. She cheated on me. She got tired of it. It's cool though. Y'all already know why? Because call me Young Love Baby Mama. If you're going to call me crazy and delusional, put Young Love Baby Mama in front of it. Ain't no other way. Y'all see, my baby daddy said she wants the girls with the green hair because she got tired of the girls with the pink hair. So what do we do, baby? Bleach my hair all day. Yes, ma'am, I did. Oh, she likes the girl with the pink hair. Got her hair pink. She has off her eyebrow. Girl, she was over here proposing to her. I'm pretty sure y'all seen a lot of people post that. I don't need to post that. But proposing to her, doing a whole bunch of stuff. It was a lot. It was so much levels to this. It's not even funny. It's not even funny. Since 2024, of them coming back, Laura behind the camera, so now she gonna show her face and never show her face. And then it's just like making everybody so excited to see her again. Like, she's gonna look the same way. She's a skinny stud. They, she just looks the same way. She probably is adding another tattoo on her face or two. That's probably it. Could you see the little young low thing on her eyebrow? Whoop t do. That's the only difference it gives. Like, there's nothing special about her face. We've seen her face mad times in the past. Like, please. You're not that cute like you think you are, baby. Let me tell you that. So, anybody giving them clout and all of this? It's like, you giving them clout for what, though? They only going to use the clout just to keep talking shit. They, they want to say, oh, y'all all peasants, and y'all bow down to them, y'all talk crap, but then y'all making them money. And then the ones who are supporting them, they'll say, yeah, to my supporters, like, they'll act all nicer for one minute, and then the next breath, they coming for them same supporters. So which one is it? Are y'all humble and y'all being grateful? Or y'all out here just literally teasing and going hard about what y'all make? And there's nothing wrong with, like, flashing and stuff like that. But y'all do it almost all the time. Like, every other time y'all come back online, y'all showing off y'all money. Y'all sending, putting stacks to y'all face and talking to it. Like, nobody cares. Like, we know you make money. Y'all did YouTube. Y'all do this TikTok thing now. Y'all y'all literally do OnlyFans. Y'all do it all for the coin. We get it. We absolutely get it already. So, I don't really understand... What's the big whoop de whoop? Y'all yeah, not that good. The skits is out of control and it's ridiculous at this point. And the acting is not even given anymore. You're washed. Straight washed. 
So with that being said, like I said, they always going to be canceled in my book. But I know y'all been wanting the tea on them. So here's the tea. And I came back with it real good this time, baby. And if y'all still want more and y'all still want more content, you know your girl going to come back with it every time. Every time, every time, every time, baby. Period. But with that being said, this is the end of this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Period, girl. It's out.